No. Okay, you're introing though. Okay, were well, you ready? Let's do this thing. Hi, everybody. Uh, welcome to the show. My name is Mike Spiegelman, and this is Hanging with My Tweeps, where I meet, greet, and tweet with the people I follow on Twitter. And I follow a lot of people on Twitter, but there's only one classy person I follow on Twitter, and her name is Marcella Arguello. Marcella, thank you so much for joining me on Hanging with My Tweeps. Thank you for having me. Marcella is in Los Angeles. She's a very, very funny comedian. I would definitely check her out. Marcella Comedy is her uh, Twitter handle. Uh, I follow her. How, how often do you tweet? As often as my mind allows me. Now, when you are hanging out, do you always have your phone with you? Are you always like I this? do. I'm kind of, I am one of those annoying people, but I do have good manners. So, like, if I'm at dinner, I usually don't have it out. All right, pop quiz, hotshot. You're on the BART with me. Do you talk to me, or do you tweet and play Angry Birds? Um, if there's reception, I might tweet. <laughs> if we're going underground, I'll, I'm going to talk to you happily. All right. Well, thanks very much. I, uh, I, I took a BART ride with a comedian, and the moment we got in there, she pulled out Angry Birds, and I'm like, you know what? Oh, that's rude. I, I w yeah, well, you know, comics are driven, Marcella. It's not about making friendship with Mike Spiegelman. It's about <laughs> being out there. <laughs> that's true. You are worthless, Mike Spiegelman. I am worthless. So tell me, uh, you're in Los Angeles. Tell me what comics do to each other. To name me some other awful shit that you've seen. Um, oh, comics are always awful with each other. It's just, yeah. It's, it's weird. It's you know, especially like coming from San Francisco, everybody was more of a community and pretty supportive. I mean, I don't know how it is now, but it still seems that way. We're all dicks. No, you're not all dicks. We're not all dicks in San Francisco, and like, cause in LA, people are like really. It's not even just driven. They're just ruthless. Yeah. I guess that's... Um, well, you need to be driven. Like, I'm not very driven. But if you're driven, you could get to a point. And then there's ruthlessness. Yeah. yeah. And most of the comics in L.A. are ruthless. Um, like, I met an L.A. comic over at Cynics Cave. I'm going to plug that show here in San Francisco. Yeah. And uh, he was out having a smoke. It was his whole entire show. He was supposed to be there on stage the entire time. But he went up for a smoke. And then he... Uh, I said, hey, I'm Mike Spiegelman, a comedian, and he totally ignored me. Yep. Sounds about right. On Valencia Street yeah. in San Francisco. Yeah. Not, not, not outside the Ice House. Did I say it right? But you said it was an L.A. comic. It, yeah, and he wasn't very good either, so I didn't really... Yeah, exactly. Worry. He's an L.A. Yeah, comic. Yeah. He's not very good. Of course he's a dick. <laughs> Tell me about the nice things in L.A. What's a nice uh, comedy thing that happened to you recently? A uh, nice comedy thing that happened to me recently? You know what? You know Baron Vaughn? Yes, I know Baron Vaughn, absolutely. We, we were doing a show together. It was Will Weldon's show. Um, I just kind of showed up to watch a friend. I think I went to go watch Aparna, but she wasn't there or something. And then um, Baron was inebriated, we'll say. And Baron just was like, well, after he watched me, he goes, Marcella, you're a real comic. You write jokes and you perform jokes and you are a real comedian and that's why I like you. And I was like, that's the nicest thing anyone has ever said to me. No one says that. I mean, what's less? <laughs> no one ever like respects you for being a good comedian, you know? I'll tell you, there is one comedian in San Francisco that I, I flat out told him I enjoy watching you. Do you know what I mean? It's Brendan yeah. Lynch. He's one of those like. Oh yeah. Yeah, there's some comedians where you just the love of comedy comes back when you watch them and. Right. He right. might be a contemporary, but the guy is super funny. So that's a great compliment. Yeah, no, it was, yeah, it was it was really nice because I was like, no one has ever said something that nice to me about comedy, you know? <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, it must be really difficult. I don't really have the balls to go up on stage, but man, it must be really difficult. That's my favorite. Oh, I don't have the guts to go on stage and to face myself like you do. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so that's let's uh. Let's check it out. So this show, we uh, we just met, and we uh, we greeted and meeted with Marcella, and now we're going to go tweeting. So I'm going to go on to the Twitter, and uh, this show is live, and I encourage people to join us live right now. Uh, we are using a hashtag. This is my thing, uh, HWMYTweeps. And so if you want to join us and tweet with us, just add that hashtag, and I can find it. So let's go check out. Can you see the screen? I can see the screen, yes. Okay, let me make sure that the people at home are. They're just probably looking at you, Marcella. Okay, here we go. Uh, I switched that over. It's very this, – I can't wait for the 21st century to actually happen, and then I, I don't have to deal with this primitive stuff. So <laughs> you are in Los Angeles. 
Uh, here we go. L.A. Done. What's trending in Los Angeles? Uh, hashtag what if. Hashtag 100 things I love. Turn up. This is us. Let's see what this is us. Girls like it when. What do you say? Girls like it when? All right. All right. So I am. let's go get some inspiration and see what the top ones are. Take your time. Girls like it when you can. Uh, whatever. God, dude. Uh, Their lashes are on point. I like that one. <laughs> when you show them up. All right, so there's a lot of graphics on this one, but there's someone. Girls like it when you don't beat them. Hashtag Chris Brown. That's a true. That's true. We don't. We, we like that when you don't do that. Yeah, I guess so. What's the other hashtag you're using? HWMT? MY. Hanging with my tweeps. HW. That's hanging with. And then uh, MY. My. And then tweeps, like in the name. All right, so uh, Marcel is using her space age 21st century phone to talk to us live on YouTube. So I'm going to go ahead and look at Marcella's uh, Twitter feed and do it. So why don't we go uh, start hashtagging? Um, it's girls you... like it when, right? Yeah. Goodness gracious. <laughs> yeah, I guess not beating up people is a good one. Um, All right, so girls like it when, and then I'll put in my hashtag at the end, H-W-M-Y, tweeps. Girls like it when, oh, come on. This is live. I hate this thing. All right, here we go. Girls um, like it when you call them women after... Very... Very modern. Which is in stop being girl. <laughs> yeah, right? That's not, you know, hey, where's the boys at? Boys like it when. Right. <laughs> let's see how you're doing on this. Um, I'm not doing at all. Um, let's see. Girls <laughs> like it when. Um, I'm trying to think. I know it's tough, right? you got to put you on the mark. When you're on this, yeah, when you're on the spot. Um, but it's, it's a good one. Let's see. You're typing something. I'm gonna. <laughs> I don't even. I'm, this is. I don't want to get gra I'm gonna. Get, I'm gonna get gross. That's the problem. I don't want to be gross. I want to be. Be funny. true. Be true to your voice. Be true <laughs> to your voice. You got people are subscribing to you because they want to hear your voice. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Girls like it when. I could make a Three Stooges joke, but, you know, how old am I? Do it. <laughs> no, it's like so. All right. Girls like it when uh, you stop watching Three Stooges. No, I can't do that one. It's not funny. Delete, 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 delete. delete. <laughs> this is going to be Zem. I'm going to end up deleting all of these after. <laughs> it's funny. Like, how, how many – what's your ratio of jokes to uh, – uh, to, to tweets. Like, if you... I actually throw away, like, three tweets for every one I post. I don't know. I mean, I try to stay consistent. If I don't think something is that funny, I won't post it, or I'll try to figure it out. Um, occasionally, I'll delete something just because I'm like, ugh, this is so stupid, but I don't know. You delete it, delete it after the fact? Yeah, yeah, I'll post it, and I'll just be like, this is so stupid, and nobody likes it, so I'm deleting it. It's a waste. Well, you know what's funny is uh, I don't want to brag I'm on Witstream, but I also use my Twitter uh, account appears on Witstream, Facebook, and then FriendFeed, I think. And so when I write something stupid, I have to immediately run to face uh, all those sites and delete them manually, uh, except for FaceFeed, uh, friend, FriendFeed. Uh, that's going to be my, uh, my, my actual archive. Yeah, I used to have them sent to – well, I do, I do have them sent to my Facebook page, uh, my, my like, my fan page. But now with my phone, I can't delete them if, if, like, I make an error, which is so annoying. I can't do it from my phone, and so it's really frustrating. Well, how many people? Do you, how many people do you think see that on Facebook? So when you I don't type know. It, I mean, it tells you. It'll say like twenty people reach, seventy people reach, five people reached, whatever. Yeah. So I don't know. Huh. All right, let's think of one more. <laughs> I hate this. This is awful. Should we do a mulligan? Should we find another one? I don't mind yeah, if find we don't. A different All one. right, let's find another one. Okay, so I'm gonna go back into the screen. Go back and delete that one. Watch. 
All right, so I'll take that out. All right, so we got a bonus tweet. Let me go up. Uh, Lola, Lola. Uh, I don't know what the kids are saying. Chicago. That's probably sports. Uh, what is this? Is us? Is this One Direction kind of crap? Oh, and blurred lines. That's the um. It is One Dimension. I forget. Mine is Robert Thicke, who's trending in Los Angeles. What if? Let's see what one if. That's pretty generic. We could think of something. Uh, yeah, let's do what if. Okay. All right. What if... All right. I'll have the... I have the we're watching Marcella Comedy tweet live. She's a human being, people. She's not just a joke machine on your Twitter feed. How many viewers do you get for this? Six. That's awesome. <laughs> They're the best people. And the main one is Carlo, right? Yes, my friend Carlo. Let's see if he watches this. Yes, this is uh it doesn't matter. This is not a podcast. That's all I care about. <laughs> do you have a podcast, Marcella? No. Why not? Um, I haven't found, um, you're going to hate this one, this tweet that I just did. Okay, I'm going to go find it. No, no. Let's go, because I'm on the screen right now, so Twitter, at <laughs> Marcella Comedy. Here we go, audience. What if Spiegelmania had more viewers in the show? <laughs> this would be worth it. All right, well, you know what? I can't follow that. <laughs> Here, let's take a look. This is cool, though. I have to say, this is very original and cool and interesting. Thanks. Yeah, it's a quick way to... <laughs> no, no, well, no. You know, that was my thing with the with the podcast, going back to what you were asking, yeah. is that um, I don't want to do it because there's so many podcasts and nobody is doing, like, um, I guess, individual ideas. Did you end it? No, I don't know what that beep was. What was that? I don't know. Someone's following us. Is that what it yeah. is when one person's following? <laughs> I'm being so, stopped. So there's two comics who they do podcasts that are more specific. Bill Burr, he, he like just wants to talk about sports, which I find fascinating because it's not. I love him, and I don't give a shit about sports, but I'll listen to it because he's so passionate, and I don't get any of the references, but it, he's so funny that it's very interesting. And there's another comic named Ian Edwards. He does one that's specifically about soccer. Oh, which that's, is, yeah. Which is so interesting to me. So I'm, because of those two guys, I'm like, I if I do a podcast, it has to be something very specific, you know? I, I absolutely agree with you. I think it's more interesting because we're not really household names yet, but we're not household yeah. names. So no one's going to be like, hey, I want to check out what that Deagleman's doing. Right, you know, right. Like, no, one, no one knows who I am. But we all know, uh, we all know stuff. So, yeah, absolutely. And that's actually, what a great way to end, Marcella. That's the beauty part of Twitter over Facebook. Facebook... <laughs> You connect with friends. Twitter, you find a subject you like, and you uh -huh. search for it, and then you exactly. find our witty jokes. Yes. So that's what we like, topics. Marcella, thank you so much. You're well, welcome. I would love to do this in the future again. I'll book you in four weeks. How's that? Sounds good. All right. So we're going to see you in four weeks, Marcella, our first reoccurring guest. Yay. Uh, thank you so much. Please tell the people who have watched the show to the end where they can see you, where uh, they can find you. Please please find me at MarcellaComedy.com. All right, fair enough, and then she'll have her schedule there. Uh, I'm on SF Barcast. If you're looking for a podcast this week, uh, check it out. Otherwise, nothing's happening. So thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next weekend. Marcella, thank you so much. Bye. Bye.